So hello, Professor Bright here. Welcome back to Destiny 2's Witch Queen expansion, where I'm still deciding if I like this new Sparrow or not. Not really a new Sparrow, it's just the one I got. New to me, but not new to the game, if that makes sense, and it should. And we're on the last chance mission, which I kind of expected to be much closer to where I was, but okay. I also haven't done any of those deep sight puzzles. What I assume are puzzles given how they've behaved elsewhere. And yeah, I... I'm curious about many things happening right now. Not least of which... Please die, thank you. Not least of which is exactly where this lead came from. How did we find out where Sabathun, uh, Converted, as it were. I don't know. Strange. Also, this is getting close to my, uh... Limits of my power. So, hmm. I might have to actually pay attention to this fight. Oh no. The horror. Hmm. Ah, uh, my, 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 my. But yes, it's a new day. Bungie probably won't kick me out this time, hopefully. Eris, hopefully. We're in oh, sorry. Where are we headed? Your destination lies deep within the fortress, Guardian, in the Apothecary Wing. Oh? There you should find a particular shard of crystal. You might recognize it from Savathun's time in the custody of the Awoken. Oh, damn. So this crystal is a piece of her former prison which means it was likely on her when she stole the light. Yes. My source believes the events leading to her escape are intrinsically linked to the mystery before us now. Oh. This crystal could very well be the clue we've been looking for. Who is your source? I mean, my assumption would be Queen Mara, but... I would just like to be sure. I've read some disturbing bits of lore, you see. That must and be I'm the curious. Wing. All the way over there. Yes. Savathun's halls are just as winding and deceitful as her mind. To move forward, you must seek out the more aberrant paths. Hmm. Fair enough. I didn't actually pay attention to what the ghost was saying there, so uh, hopefully it was nothing important. Also, I'm not full up on laurels, so now I'll be earning those for a little bit. Well, yeah. The rocket launcher is not a sword. Uh, I didn't know if you knew that, but um, they behave differently. Ahem. Ahem. I might be running. Yeah. Aberrant paths. So what looks aberrant around here? I love you, Ghost, but this is not one of the times when I needed your advice. Also, this guy's got deep sight resonance on it, so... The hell? So we'll be using it. Uh, probably don't have enough time to actually do this, but we're gonna do it anyway. Eris, what's the situation? The Guardian is en route to the object in question now, Commander. Good. You are sure this will get us well, the answers we need? fuck off! Can't okay. The Queen of the Reef right. share information lightly. Ah! Rassov gave you the tip? You didn't mention that I was before. right. I did, in fact, mention it. To Ikora, moments before you interrupted us. Wow. She agreed there was no more reliable source on this matter than Savathun's former captor. I trust Mara, but she plays her cards too close to her chest. I wouldn't trust her. If she had shared this earlier, we wouldn't be so desperate now. To win against the Hive God of Cunning and Lies, it's best not to show one's hand too early. I'm just going back to where I was. What the? I guess I came from there, but... Th okay, whatever. I feel like there was a more efficient way to get here, but you know what? Whatever. Not gonna question it. This essentially is a dreamscape kind of area. Built from the mind of a very old god, so 
Who's to say it should all make sense, right? And yeah, if I'm gonna be doing any platforming, I'd want my sword to correct my momentum should the need arise. Hi, there you are. And pop. And no. I said no. I'm pretty sure I was clear about being no. No. There we go. Oop. Give me your sword. I bet this hive sword will be just as useful as the last one. Now we need to find a lock to smash open. Yeah, I got it. have recast her realm in a lucent sheen, but remnants of dark architecture still lurk underneath. And oh. the Guardian's new ability reveals these hidden remnants. Yes, Ikora explained. Why can't we use the light to achieve the same result? The light may be a powerful force, but when dealing in illusions, it has proven insufficient. It is the mind that must bend to see the truths hidden here. Thus... Only darkness can show the way. My only fear is where that way will lead us in the end. Hmm. Concerning. Wait, is my void melee... Is my void melee enough to pop uh, stasis crystals? Because that would be... Interesting. I haven't really played around with the interaction between... Yeah, stasis. And much else. Mostly because I've had other things I've been ugh, trying to get the deep sight resonance off of. Come on, guys. Stop this. You're just embarrassing yourselves. Killing yourselves, actually. And only mildly inconveniencing me. What the hell? Oh. And there we are. Nope. Oh, uh, nope, there was something there. Okay. Ah, excellent. I was hoping for something like this. Alright, what we kill in here? Ooh, got an ogre. Well, I had an ogre. What do you got against me, huh? Is this the best you have, Sabathun? We both know that's not true. And I gotta say, I'm more intrigued by our quote-unquote enemy. I don't know. I don't know. I'm thinking that witness is more of a problem than... Savathun. Come on. But we'll see. We shall see. Man, you guys are doing a lot of defending this area for some reason. Oh, hey! You even have a little uh, light bear. Well, let me fix that for you. No. Although it does almost look like they disappear before you kill them. Is that just me? Hmm. You've done well honing the gift granted to you by the Black Fleet, Guardian. Do you see now, Commander, why Ikora chose as she did? For all her doubts, she knew only darkness, channeled by a strong mind, could bring us this far. I understand. My issue isn't with the call Ikora made. I mean, I made it too. That she made it on her own. That's what you guys are fighting about. Operates. She singles hmm. people out for a reason. There's no need to make her job any easier. And Eris, I think you know better than anyone that darkness is not a path to be forged alone. I mean... She wasn't alone. Though, I take your point. Yeah. I know, Eris did pretty okay. Well, <laughs> relatively okay on her own. It's like, she did fine when she was desperately... Climbing through the ruins of, well, not even ruins, 
through the hive architecture on the moon. That was fine, right? Yeah. No, that's a little, uh, hmm. A wee bit dishonest. I wish my little laurel thing would just max out already so I didn't have these showing up all over the place. But, yeah, well. Um, they're underneath me, aren't they? Yep. Nope, nope. And then... Huh. That's kind of convenient. Hmm. Alright. Thinking how I can use some of these things in other... Oh. Really? Kind of dick move there, but whatever. Yep. Kids and you're running away from my... Uh, fusion rifle. I don't even really want to be using. It just has deep sight resonance, so I kind of got to finish it up. For the sake of it. Eh, 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 eh. And no. Stop. Cease. Foolishness. Go away. Ho! Ha ha ha! Yeah, you thought you were going to get me to jump off, but you did not. I kind of preferred it when the sword had the little smash. Well, I say that. This is much more viable for killing wizards and the like. What? Hmm. What the? Oh. Oh, well. Got rid of one lock. Oh. <laughs> okay. For the sake of it. Oh. That used to be like a... It used to have like a huge wave to it, too. Oh, that's a shame. At least it regenerates quickly, but I mean, come on. And yeah, apparently I forgot this lock. I didn't really forget it. I just didn't know there was a lock there. That's on me. Do you mind? Oh, well. Not quite how I wanted that to go down, but sure. Oh. Could you not? I simply ask that you don't. Really? There we go. This is like the worst use of a fusion rifle, but meh. Really? Okay, fine. Be that way. See if I care. It's fine. Hmm. Hmm. I say. Hmm. This is definitely the apothecary Ooh. wing. Somehow, it feels even creepier in here. I don't know, I kind of love it. You're trespassing on the testing grounds for the Lucent Hive's most wretched experiments. Ah, good. I can... Wow, that pronunciation was weird in my head. Uh, give me a minute, guys. I just need to get rid of this thing. Do 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 mutable element, I guess. Doesn't really matter to me. So we're gonna Yeah, we're definitely gonna get rid of that. And I'm gonna switch out for the Graviton Lance, actually. Because while I love this, I mean Ah uh, I do love this more. You know, I say that. I don't think I'm finished with the I'm not finished with masterworking the sunshot, so... Yeah, it would be more beneficial to use this. Just gotta focus on getting the explosion kills. 
not as good from a strictly Sovereign hmm. likely appointed one of her high council wizards to keep watch over this place. Find them. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The crystal is sure to be nearby. Nice. Like how that changed. Ah, oh, God, the chain of explosions is just too good. It's too good. Tis beautiful. Oh, come on now. Hmm. How do you... Yeah, you don't blast. Okay. And how are my friends? They are dead. Nope. Nope. Ooh. Okay, that could have been dangerous. I'm sorry, what was that about? Um. Oh. Okay. No signs of a crystal so far. Just rows and rows of jars filled with... Is that light? But it's tainted somehow. Savathun has always encouraged hmm. her wizards to push boundaries of hive magic. It seems that hasn't changed with the light. Huh. Perhaps that corruption has far less to do with the power than the one channeling it. Or the power has perfect side effects. Darkness transforms Savathun into kin for prey to predators. Not darkness itself. But an entity behind it corrupted the hive. Conditioned their power on an endless blood tithe. Their fate is not inevitable. I have no doubt that some can handle darkness with discipline. But those who can't, they're not the only ones to pay the price. Hmm. Questions upon questions upon questions. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this last episode because it got cut short. I'm kind of wondering how someone who knew nothing about the Book of Sorrows or anything from the Taken King would react to this expansion. I'm just kind of curious, is all. It's still fun, I think, but there's a lot of lore being dropped that I feel like without the context of the lore and the previous story wouldn't hit as hard. Which is fine. I mean, other games have shown that you can do story well, and... Oh, there we go. Have a continuous story. Okay, that is getting a little messy. Like, not every expansion needs to be an entry point, as it were. If that makes sense. You can just continue on the story, build it up, make something epic out of it instead of a bunch of short little vignettes. Yep, this might be a bad one. Also, I think I could have got here without the deep sight, but eh. Eh, I say. This is an inverted realm. Explore you sure? any and all directions. Especially those you least suspect. So far, it's kind of all, um... Very straightforward. Just go up the tower. Apparently, there's gonna be a big fight here, based on the rally banner. Looks like we're interrupting something. But where's the wizard overseeing all this? Probably through there. Oh, hey. I think we just found the one in charge around here. Oh, damn. Good. Now go and beat the whereabouts of the crystal out of them. The wizard just fled. Follow them. They're closing ranks around the crystal. Are they? Are you sure about that? And I wonder if that's something that Savathun ordered or if it's something that they did on their own. I don't know. Hmm.
How high? Ooh. Dangerous. Okay. Ah. There's just the one exploder. Okay. The one cursed thrall. Ah, but we have a light bearer. Okay. I'm gonna have to make sure you don't get a chance to use your abilities. There's the crystal guardian. Time to finish this. Oh shit. Dang it, stop using my own abilities against me! Cease! Oh, sorry. Your ghost is gone too. Just a side note. Yeah, hold that thought for a minute. Um. Yeah, actually. Yeah, hmm. This is fine. Anywho, shield breaker robes. I don't remember there being such a thing. But regardless, hmm. Devotion inspires bravery. Oh. Bravery inspires sacrifice, and sacrifice. That was Sabathun, all right. But what does that mean? This is the evidence hmm. we've been seeking all along. Ikora's instincts were correct, after all. Indeed. But we don't have our answers yet. Go unlock the memory, Guardian. Then let's see if this cracks the case. Yeah, we're gonna do that right away, because that's the same speech. I don't know how many people will remember this. But that's the same speech that uh, the speaker gave in the Red War. He gave the speech to Gaul. And if you haven't experienced the Red War, that means nothing to you. But uh, I have experienced the Red War, and I'm intrigued. I think I was right in assuming that the Traveler willingly gave Sabathun the Light. In fact, I am almost positive I'm right. Let's head over there. I'm also curious about the birthplace of the vial. It might be something that's like after the eh, campaign. But it could also be something related to the campaign. And they talked about corrupted light. Corrupted light, how? Like, how was it corrupted? Corrupted with darkness? Corrupted with something else? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I could help with that, but uh, by the time I get there, it's probably going to be done. Besides, the Aether Abomination implies that they did not get it through to Heroic, which is unfortunate, because I believe I need to do a Heroic version of the Aether Ritual. Oh, is that the one I've done and it's the other two I need? I don't remember. It's also irrelevant, I suppose, for now. I also have to look up how to make that resonant splinter public event go heroic. I assumed that it was throwing the little uh, orbs at the splinter, but that didn't seem to work last time. Might be I just didn't do it enough. Might be there's something else you throw them at. We'll learn in the future. Oh, there goes There's another sparrow. I just go through too many of those. That's got to be real annoying. Uh, to my dear little ghost. Just constantly having to rebuild it. You'd think they'd have better defenses here by now, given how many times I've just shown up and killed every Scorn in the area. But also, this was sealed, right? Am I... Am I wrong? Hmm... 
Access the altar. Show me what's going on there. Am I going to get a cutscene, or is it going to just have me play through the area? Hmm. Nope, area, okay. I've read some of Ikora's notes on the darkness and the light, Guardian. She thinks the darkness is closely linked with memory. You Curious. access this place with the darkness power. What exactly have we tapped into here? Ah, right. Need a little more precision, which means pop and I still don't know how this worked, but so two has something different. Oh, wait, it's just that they, oh, it's just that they're different from the other. Okay. I feel like I was overthinking that by a lot, if that's the same as what we already did. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see here. So those are the same, same, same. Wait, these are all the same. No, no, that one was different. Okay. I see from the top one. Um, but yeah, these are all the same, though. So it's just this one that's different. That's A-O-O-T-O. A-O-O-T-O. -O -O -O. Okay. That's the only one that's different there. A O O T O A O O T O A O O T O. Yeah, the. Oh, is there another? Ah. Uh... A O O T O A O O T O A O A. Okay. Beep, 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 uh, what was I using before? Right, shotgun. The shotgun that I'm trying to level up. Although I would like a different kinetic, honestly. Actually, I would love having a hand cannon. That could customize. Honestly, hand cannons are kind of overdone, I would say, in terms of exotics, but you know. You know, I kind of can't resist. Well, you can see her crown from here. Wow, okay. Huh. Alright, Sarash, where are you? I would love nothing more than to have fun with you. And by fun, I mean rip your part. Nope. I said no to you. Ooh, got to see that in third person. Nice. Oh, hey, yeah, um... Oh, well, it would help if I had had this charged. Alas. Yeah, I've seen a lot of people that look a lot like you. Hmm. 
Look an awful lot like the champion of uh, Zevo Wrath that we saw not that long ago. Actually, I suppose it was a full year back in the season of the hunt. Question mark. Y'all know I'm not good with names. Uh, pop, pop. I get more, yes. And, oh. There we go. Very nice. So, Savathun, hi, how's it going? You're looking as lovely as ever. Hmm, and I wonder... But can I also see the... Wait, what? Okay. Can I also see the memory associated with that worm statue, though? Oh. I saw the end before it happened. My own death, brought on by the separation from my power. And in these final moments, I look to the sky. Oh. Now the world begins to fade. Hmm. Oh, now that is. kind of beautiful. I'm not going to lie. That was... Huh. I'm impressed. You pulled that off nicely. So... Incredible that I could forget something like that, isn't it? Such a storied life, erased. The light offers us a fresh start, but if we don't know where we came from, how will we know where to go? I'm so grateful to you for reminding me, for telling my story. Wait. What is she talking about? She remembers. We helped her remember. Yeah. Thanks for the memories, Guardian. We have to leave. 
wouldn't be the worst of ideas. Okay. All right. That was pretty damn good. Huh. All right, Bungie. I love the twist. I love that twist. Because we were in sort of like a, her mindscape. The throne world is kind of her mindscape. And she was watching those memories. We saw her watching them. Savathun having the light. But the truth is so much worse. It's so much better. The traveler could choose her the same way it chose you. We need to talk to Zavala. Oh, he's gonna be pissed about it. But I mean, yeah. Oh, this is such a good. Oh, I love this. <laughs> I legitimately love this sort of twist to the story. Like, we kind of saw it coming when they mentioned that, you know, the Traveler would just be offered a way out of all this fighting, because, at least in my case, I remember the lore where it's like, the Traveler didn't want any of this. They ran. They abandoned the Elixni. So, of course, if you offer the Traveler a way to just live its life in peace, away from its enemies, it's probably going to take it. God. But I don't know why... Well, I can think of several reasons, but I'm not sure exactly why Savathun was uh, making that offer. Hmm. Hmm. Could be to weaken the Guardians. Could be just to preserve the Traveler. And it seems like that was part of a plan. Maybe... Possibly even a plan between her and the Traveler. Did she speak with the Traveler? Oh, so many questions. I love this. Anyway, none of this is getting me where I need to go. Um, yeah, apparently I have to go to the tower. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. We're going to go a little bit late here. But God, that's so cool. Oh, wait, we're going to his office. Okay, that's even... Just, ah. I knew the Traveler revived her. Like, decided to revive Savathun. It wasn't any like, oh yeah, she stole the light. It was just like, yeah, the Traveler can revive whoever it wants to with the ghosts. It has some level of control over them. How much? Don't know. But, it was able to make at least one ghost for the Hive. And how many more did it make? Did it release more ghosts? They just instruct ghosts that had been searching for their partner, as it were, their guardian. Huh. Fascinating. Okay. Okay. All right, Bungie. Love what they did with this. Also, I have a ton of things I need to actually do here, but eh, they can wait. All right, can't jump. All right, okay, yep. That was deliberate. All of that, totally, totally deliberate. I meant to do that. Ah, uh, oh, we're going. Well, we're going a little bit late, but that's fine. I just, I want to know. Hey, Zavala. That, uh, that god you've had so much faith in, eh, maybe it didn't have as much faith in us as you would think. So, you're saying Sabathun was dead? Yeah. Our most devious adversary, the one who nearly decimated the last city from within, was dead and the traveler resurrected her yep i wouldn't have believed it either but but why would she need us to recover her memories if she never lost them in the first place this has to be another trick a lie to fool us into surrendering the traveler without a fight 
What do you mean, surrender this the traveler? Has been the traveler's approach from the beginning. Yeah. The books of sorrow detail many civilizations it blessed with the light, then abandoned. Yep. Propaganda. Are you sure? The fallen tell the same story. When the witness and its black fleet came to call, the traveler moved on to our system. Or it sacrificed itself to save humanity from the same forces. Forces which included the Hive! After all that, why would the Traveler give our worst enemy the light? Because they had a better offer than us. Matter. Oh, I think it does. I don't know why the Traveler gave Sabathun the light. Maybe it has changed its mind about Guardians. Maybe it's not as infallible as we once believed. Maybe it's a selfish prick. I don't know, and it doesn't matter. I, it really does. I'm here to protect humanity. And if Savathun takes the Traveler, we lose our light. Along with any hope for surviving the Witness's return. I mean, I still have my darkness abilities, so it doesn't... Really matter to me? Takes to stop this heist? We will do. All right. How do we stop this? I'm not sure yet. But I know where to find out. Hmm. I'm intrigued. Wait. Wait, are we going to make a deal with the worm gods? Like, I don't want to predict too much, because I don't know how they're going to resolve this storyline. I hope it doesn't end with Savathun dying, because that would make me a little disappointed. But, oh, god, this is, this is getting interesting. This is getting very interesting. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I hate to leave it on a cliffhanger, but... But, I think we do have to stop there uh, for today. Oh, just, mm. I want to talk to Ikora right now, but, right now, we need to wait for a next episode. For now, thank you all for your time. Know the like, comment, and subscribe buttons below. Use them responsibly, and I will see you all soon. Goodbye. Ooh, I'm so excited.